Alert from Tampa and the kind of story that is impossible to make sense of and it's just heartbreaking to hear a little four year old girl has died and her mother is in custody after police say she threw the little girl into the Hillsborough River. Fox 13's Evan Axelbank is joining us now. What can you tell us, Evan? Well, Kelly, even the police officers out here, you can see just from their faces how distraught they are. I just want to show you over my shoulder. Police believe this is uh, the main area. This is uh, just about uh, uh, the area here where they are focusing on in their investigation. What they believe is that at around 4 o'clock, reports started coming in that a woman had thrown her child into the Hillsborough River. I just spoke to a police uh, source, a police spokesperson, who says that the woman actually walked out into the water with the child, holding the child, and then did what I'm told was some sort of a toss. It took police officers about 30 minutes to recover that child. They say when they did, she was lifeless. She was pronounced dead at the hospital. She was put into an ambulance, obviously taken there, but she did not make it. They say they found her about 75 feet offshore. Now, police officers right now are focusing part of their investigation on a vehicle that is um, over my shoulder here right now. I'm not sure if you can see it uh, from the aerial picture that we have, but police officers are focusing on a vehicle that uh, is here with a price sticker still on it. So that is a bit unusual. There's a pair of shoes next to that. Police officers are uh, walking around that vehicle and taking a look at it. We understand that the woman is in custody, taken in by police a short distance from here. So it appears that she drove here and then left this uh, immediate area on foot. The police chief did a press conference at about 515. He said simply, this is a crazy world we live in. Our dive team responded. We had units here immediately. And unfortunately, at about 430, literally 30 minutes later, our dive team about 75 feet offshore recovered the body of a, of a uh, young child. Uh, we believe the child is four years old, and at this point, we believe it's the, uh, the, the woman who did this. We believe it, we think it's her daughter. And so right now, the search for answers is on. Uh, oftentimes, in cases like these, you don't get great answers. You don't get any answers. Right now, police officers focusing on that vehicle uh, right now. You can see them right now. Not sure if you can over that uh, police officer's uh, SUV, but right now, police officers are... Um, uh, interviewing the woman, they're speaking with her, they're trying to figure out why this happened, what condition she was in, what was going on before this, what led up to this in the days before. Those are all going to be things as part of the investigation, just based on previous investigations we've seen in this area that have, uh, you know, some relation or something to do uh, with the you know circumstances that we've seen here this evening. Oh, just heartbreaking and like you said earlier we may never know what the the motive was there and I know you're going to keep us updated if you find out anything more. Thank you so much Evan.